This is the Alea story. They're just flat pieces of wood that we really enjoy surfing. It all started when I saw these boards in the Bishop Museum in Hawaii in 2004. I was so impressed with the boards that I've been pursuing them ever since. my brother talking about these boards he's been riding for about six months and I decided I got to go down to Noosa and see what he's doing and I uh, came down with an open mind and we found some uh, small waves while I was here and we've had such a blast every day riding, riding the smallest possible waves and having the best amount of fun. Uh, I've been surfing a long time and always trying to make the small days as fun as possible and uh, with these boards you're so close to the to ride in the wave that uh, it's very exciting. You know when you're always sitting on the beach wishing that you could ride that small of a wave, those perfect waves you always see. And with these boards, it seems like you can get on them and get a really good go, go real fast, and uh, probably get in the tube a lot, right, on those small little tubes. As a shaper, you know, we try so hard to come up with the next new thing, and it's, it's, it's nice to know that you can just really step back into the past and ride boards that you think are so simple, but they're really, really advanced for riding waves. comes 
a television And it's trying hard to get under my skin But blood can be How is that, Matt? pretty relentless sometimes Yeah, blood can be What do you think of the LA? Yeah, so much fun, they go so fast What do you think of Johnny's new fish model? Yeah, it's good Took a little chip off the front, but we'll fix it Here we are at Tea Tree Bay, Noosa Heads, and we'll be checking out the stand-up Alea. We'll be meeting Jacob Stuth, but first here's Matt, my apprentice, who helps me make the boards. My brother John, who is now making these Aleas in Southern California, and me and Jake. Jacob Stuth is the absolute master of the stand-up Alea. Now here we go with some guys, John, Matt, and Chris, and that's Chris right there, trying the stand-up Aleas for the first time. And they are not easy to ride. Just catching a wave on one is just amazingly difficult. And angling across the face takes a whole different style of surfing that's just totally opposite to riding aboard of the fin. And Jake's giving him some tips here, but still it's difficult. But amazingly, after this day, Chris, right there, he ordered an Alea. My brother's, again, making them over in the States right now. And Matt was just extremely stoked.
us. I think, I think by watching it, like the 10 footer was, was a bit smoother, and I think with a little bit more bulbous nose, you might get the same length. You might uh, get a little bit more smoothness. Take off your sandals, feel the earth beneath your feet. 